Hello, my friends. Welcome back to the Mobius mod. We are jumping into the magical death land of Taldorim, and I am not, <laughs> I am not going to do well here. This one's going to be really hard. This mission in Nightmare, I remember, is insane. So, <laughs> um, wish me luck. <laughs> I'm, oh no. We're gonna need a lot of bunkers, probably a mobile force with the Goliaths as, and then bunkers with Marines in them, medics and maybe some SUVs to repair. There's gonna be a lot of stuff that we gotta get going. Probably pretty darn quickly. <gasps> we got Egon. We got Egon, we're fine. So, I was thinking about what hero should we get at the beginning? I think that Jim is the right call here because there's a lot of armored enemies. I don't know if his penetrator round actually hits air. Uh, I think that it, I may have tested it previously. I don't remember if I did. I don't think it hits air. And we can check out the Spartan who has no abilities yet. <laughs> oh, hi. How are you? <laughs> We're under attack already. Neat. All right. We are going to jump on over to this bonus objective. Grab it. We get nothing. We have a message from the Hyperion. Commander. This terrazine gas seems very interesting. If you prevent the Protoss from closing a few of the vents, I can discreetly, I can send discreetly a few drones to collect samples. This would allow for fantastic leap in my long-term researches. They can also be sold at great prices when I'm done. Oh. Oh, I guess it's just uh, it doesn't actually give more research. It just gives minus five thousand credits per sealed. You know what? I'll take it. So yeah, I think this is only ground, but it'll still be great against those ground people. Particularly, wait, this can't one-shot probes. No, it can't. Darn. <laughs> I was thinking that we'd be able to pow, get them from long range, and then they wouldn't be able to do anything against us. Well, that isn't going to happen now, is it? Now, I did get the Reaper, but I'm not convinced the Reaper is going to be great on this mission. Because the enemy doesn't have a whole lot of light stuff. They might have some Zealots, though. Yeah, maybe I'll get some because they can hit air. We'll give that a go. And they're probably going to move over here next. Where do I, where do I want to go? How do I want to do this? I think that what I want to do is stop them from capping. Try to clear out the base. Because we're going to need a good economy very quickly here. And then we will be able to kind of move around easily. What I'm afraid of is if we don't get the base in the middle, then they're going to start sealing over here and over here, and it'll be real tough to get over to them. And we got to keep that money. Let's just, uh, let's just chill right there. I think that's a good place. Now, there is one thing that I wanted to talk about a little bit before we get too far into that, and that is spoilers. So, people are obviously very excited about this, and it is a mod that is to the public. Like, you guys can play it right now. If you check the description of these videos, it is there on where to get it. Now, people have been very excited to talk about stuff that's upcoming in the future in the YouTube comments. And I'm going to ask that people stop doing that, because I don't think it's fair to those who want to, you know, experience it naturally as it comes but they want to be able to discuss what's going on in the day's episode. It's really not a big thing. It's just, you know, I think that it's fair to help people avoid those spoilers. So, what are we going to do? I'm putting Stepman in the front so he can soak some shots. That is immortal. Oh, okay, they have the hardened shields right from... Wings Liberty, so he only takes 10 damage from Jim's penetrator round. I didn't think about that. Also, apparently the mercenaries are currently non-functional. This is not a fully completed mod. And it's just cheaper versions of the units right now, instead of being like more powerful things for the same price. Uh, some of them are cheaper, some of them are not, and some of them are misnamed. And we're just going to roll with it as the, like, time duration little buff thing. However, it's not, like, super impactful. Okay, we have a base over here, don't we? Let's go grab this right now. 
And probably need to make sure everything here is dead because I'm afraid that the enemy is going to, like, try to rebuild it or something. <laughs> and then we're going to swing down. What type of scouts are these? These are the bonus versus light scouts. So I actually want to put these goliaths in the front. Oh, the stalkers are dumb. Stalkers are dumb. They're like me. <laughs> oh, they don't notice anything. So one thing, this is a nightmare difficulty change that I really like, and I kind of wish was in the mace game. There is a shield around the probe. I forgot about that until just now, and it is, it's a good change. It means that you have to actually fight the guys. Maybe I don't wish it was in the base game because, you know, doing some cheesy stuff is fun every once in a while, but I'm glad that it's a nightmare. It uh, definitely makes things a bit more interesting. Now we are going to grab three bunkers over here and keep this area nice and safe. We're also going to get an armory for both the Goliath upgrades and the Shrike turret upgrades, which <laughs> I mean, it's, it's not going to be huge, but it's going to be something and I like it. I believe that the next capture attempt, Oh, that is unfortunate timing. Uh, those are scouts, so they're not going to be able to kill it. Thank goodness. Just don't send the SCVs over there yet. That is a lot of scouts. They're attacking Jim. They kind of switch targets multiple times, and I am happy with that. Okay, let's go. And we're going to rally the barracks over here. And we'll keep these guys around to repair. Oh, yep, they're rebuilding. We're going to have to get good defenses around everywhere. This is a mission that really benefits from just having those walls fortifying everything. Uh-oh. Well, these are just scouts. It's fine. And then once I get a little bit more money. Oh, you know what we can grab with Jim? That's going to be awesome. We're going to be able to hit him with the legend or hit the hit the most legendary unit in this mission. I think that was a capture wave. I'm not entirely sure. All right. We're going to snipe the only warp in Colossus in StarCraft 2. We got him. <laughs> Warped out. That should be an achievement. dodged. Now I've lost a little bit of stuff so far, but honestly, it's not too bad. Got some sentries and stuff. I think we're just going to rally that like that. Whoa, whoa. Well, that's not good. Uh, let's see. Mercenaries. <laughs> that is a lot of guys. Oh no. Save me, Obi-Wan Turdoni. And then we have to get all the way over to the side. I feel like I lost a lot. Also, I'm supply capped. How did that happen? Okay. Now we gotta, we gotta book it. Wait, where's the ceiling attempt? Did we stop it? I think we did. Well, if we can't fight the High Templar safely, then we can burn him. He can storm this loser. Oh, storm reduces movement speed. Oh. That is a good thing that we noticed right here. So, as we get more Goliath stuff, I want to grab Jim again. And we'll get Tychus. He's cool. And then now that we have Jim back, I want to start moving to those upgrades for the Goliaths, because I think that I'm going to want a lot of these guys. I'm not seeing any Templar here. We're clear. Oh gosh, that's a lot of stuff. We got it, we got it. Factory, factory, factory. Okay, we stopped the ceiling. 
I am floored that we stopped the ceiling. And then grab this. All right. Missiles can be fired while moving. Oh, bro. Oh, 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 oh my goodness. We need to get these factories online faster. That's cray cray. Oh my goodness. How many more guys do I need in here? A bunch. Okay, we're just gonna queue up a bunch over there. And I guess I need to fix these hotkeys. Get Tychus on over with the force. And I wanted to I want to beat one more attack wave first. Yeah, these require attack lab, okay. And then after we beat another attack wave, I can move and get the second Goliath upgrade. I think that's a safe and sensible way to do it. And let's get Rory. He's our swan song. Add on complete. I may have built too many factories now. This is fine. What's the plan? Sounds like a plan. Let's come on. Hit me, baby. Here we go. Nice capture attempt. Oh, this is that one. <laughs> they just sent for probes. Wait, where's your friends? Here they are. Jim, do that helpful thing. I actually think that these fire bats are doing a great job with their armor. It is legitimately soaking the void ray shots when they're not doing too much damage as they charge up. It seems legit. I know that seems weird, but I, I am truly enjoying the fire bat. They're not getting a lot of kills, but that's fine. That's not what they're here for. Okay, so this is another nightmare thing. The amount of money on these bases was reduced, and instead a base was added up here to force people to actually like have to engage with the entire map, because for the most part, people would ignore the top right, except they grab the bonus objective at the end. That felt a bit weird. Oh, hello. Whoa! Okay, there is a storm. Where's your stormer? They're sending Tychus to find him. I don't. Oh, I didn't see what the upgrade was. I was so busy. Uh. Uh oh. Did it not require a tech lab now? That might be. It. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I was. I was trying to not get stormed. Hmm. That's not good. Not a whole lot over here. Keep everybody safe. Let's get a couple field responses, some Prometheans. Do we try to bust the base? I mean, supply is high. There's infinite resource pickups. Yeah, we're gonna do it. We're gonna regret it. I mean, this is, <laughs> it's such a bad idea, Grant. But these, it's so many, it, firewall moving. Wait, is it only missiles at firewall moving? Okay, mi the anti-air fires while moving, got it. We're gonna take this base. We're gonna have a ton of money. One thing that's interesting about having that base up there is you can actually have higher income than normal because you can get that three base income temporarily if you need it. It's interesting. Oh, these guys are just trying to rebuild stuff. I see. I think we're gonna build some stuff over there. And is this the double cap attempt? I think it is. One down. And I should clear out this area of the map as well. So that I can more easily move about. Oh no, the sentries! The tickle beams! That is a Fire Colossus. Gotta be very careful there. And a Void Ray. What's happening? Okay. We baited out a bunch of High Templar energy, which is... You know what? That's actually pretty good. So we can just roll over these losers. And then 
we gotta take everybody here except for a couple guys. Bring them up to the top. I do not need the gas. I think we want two guys. Oh, I can't put it anywhere closer. It kind of looked like I could, but the gases were blocking. And I'm going to try to push up over here. See how that goes. I think it's going to go great. I feel it. They're just like throwing guys away. The heal thing. Doing, doing good. Pull back. Out of the storms. Well, I'm going to lose a little bit of money because I decided to do this, but I think this is interesting. Oh, no. Well, they're capping the thing and they're counterattacking. Huh. Whoa! A mothership! Um. Alright. Pull everything back. See what we can keep alive. Mass repairs. Try to save that area. Take this down. Okay, they're not producing from four of their gateways. Build, build, build. Uh, a lot of you guys can turn into Hercs. So we can continue the, continue the push. And the boys are doing great. Big wave over here. Repair bot. Yeah, repair that guy. Oh, Tychus is down somewhere. Yeah, he fell over. No! Here, if that guy can get over there. That's all we need. <laughs> oh, this isn't good. 132 supply. Here, drop, drop one of these. And send this force over to help this side out. Kill the attackers. I think this guy did it. He saved them. Things are getting real. Okay, finish these off. It looks like the Colossus went down. We can... Attack those guys over here. We have a lot of money in the bank, and I need to start building some depots. Just like Void Ray's chilling out over there with flux veins, but I think we got him. Ooh, -hoo, clear a nightmare difficulty. Taldorim base on this mission is one of those things that's on my bucket. Obviously, this isn't normal nightmare difficulty, but still, it was something I had wanted to do. And I'm glad. The mothership really caught me off guard. I don't know which version of the game that's from. <laughs> that's awesome. These guys going. That sounds a core hall. Nope. Pull all this stuff back. Where did they build an army from? I think we gotta kill this infrastructure over here, because that's probably where they're coming from, but we gotta kill the attack wave first. Target down the High Templar. We got it. Ooh. There's a thing over here. We can take the time to rescue our floor-based accomplices. And I think this is the only place... Yep, okay, that's where stuff was being built from. There was a Stargate there, too. I will say, it makes things way harder, but I really, really like... Step in! Step in! You're fine. You scared me, bro. Oh, what do we got? Just a couple more buildings. 
Oh man. The, the when <laughs> when we started fighting in three places at once, I I was not convinced things were going to go well. <laughs> but it worked. <laughs> he can't believe that it worked. Oh my goodness. Alright, no more void rays for you. Oh, these bad boys are getting nerfed. Wait, where? No. Oh, there's gonna be a whole base just rebuilt, isn't there? No. It's just this. Taldarim just can't stand up to our firepower. We did it. Oh, we did it. That was awesome. Now I actually, now I get to go look at what the Goliath upgrade is because I missed the second one. <laughs> oh man, I'm so bad. <laughs> okay, so I think that we're definitely going to get some Spartans or is that what they're called? Yeah, Spartan Company. They're very cheap, very powerful. Head to the armory. And what? Okay. Can fire ground air? Oh, wait. For some reason, I thought that they just had that naturally. I don't know why I thought they had that naturally. Is Do they have it naturally in Nova Covert Ops? I must have been playing something recently where they, by default, had grounded air and I just crossed my wires. Oh, well, it happens when you play a million billion different mods. Now, what upgrade should I get? In theory, Legionnaire upgrades are good. However, I'm kind of feeling like they're getting less and less useful as time is going on. They're, they seem like bunker friends, kind of like the Reaper. So, I'm gonna get this. And then I'll probably get this next time. They're pretty cheap. All right, this is great. Guys, thank you for watching. We are going to have to go to one of three places. Do we want to go to Meinhof for the Condor bike? The Mon Monolith for the Hammerfist guard? Or Tarsonis for the Diamondback? Hmm. That's not fancy. <laughs> oh well, I'm sure it'll be awesome. Thank you guys for watching. Please vote in the comments below where you would like to go. And I will see you tomorrow. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Peace!